Hello today's video we have the following content. Execution Judge, King Lin didn't realize what Chu Yun had made Mu Zifan lose until he found out his father-in-law's identity. The new plot of the TV series Execution Judge starring Luo Jin, Yang Zishan and others can be said to be getting more and more exciting. As the story develops, the killing group involved in Dong Ming's incident is getting bigger and deeper. Dong Ming was set up by Cheng Kilin before. He wanted to use Fang Kiang's purchase of 10% of the shares to make a fuss and wanted to sell his fitness equipment factory's land at a high price of 30 million. Unexpectedly, at the critical moment, Chen Killen's people found his handle and forced him to pack up and leave quickly. Fang Kiang didn't know that danger was approaching him. After Duong Ming left, his lover Dai Lan's beauty salon also had problems one after another. Because the inferior cosmetics he gave Dai Lan caused many people to be disfigured, Dai Lan faced huge compensation. In addition, Duong Ming took away her money. Her bestie and cousin Kin Huang suddenly appeared. Instead of helping her with money, she asked her to transfer property. Not only that, this person also took a fancy to Duong Ming's debt and wanted to get involved in Duong Ming's debt. Kin Hong is not a good person. She does things for the sake of profit, even to Director Ma. It can be seen that Director Ma has a past with her, and she only wants to use him to seek benefits for herself. Fang Kiang also encountered great danger because of this incident and was almost killed. After all, Fang Kiang holds 10% of the shares, which can easily make all of Chen Kilin's plans come to nothing. Chen Kilin will definitely try his best to eliminate this threat, even at all costs, otherwise the whole project will be in vain. At this time, the Execution Bureau also began to contact Dai Lan's case. Because she disfigured others and transferred property, she had no money to compensate. The impact of what happened after this incident was undoubtedly huge. The people in the Execution Bureau naturally began to investigate Dai Lan and found that she transferred money to another beauty salon before being executed. In order to investigate the payment of this beauty salon, Dai Lan was even the recipient. So Ki Lin and Chu Yun pretended to be a couple who were about to get married and went to the beauty salon to apply for a card, wanting to find out who the real owner of this beauty salon was. If it was confirmed to be Dai Lan, they could naturally execute this beauty salon. It must be said that the two had a good plan, but unfortunately Chu Yun did not expect that her rival Kui Shai and Chang's daughter would be exposed, and the two pretending to be lovers to investigate the beauty salon came to an end. However, after this incident, the relationship between Qi Lin and Chu Yun has changed dramatically, and Qi Lin even attended the other's class reunion. It must be said that Qi Lin and Chu Yun do have a strong sense of CP. After this misunderstanding, the two gradually came together. Although Chu Yun still has some obsession with Mu Zifin, it is obvious that Mu Zifin is holding on to Kui Shai and Chang's thighs and will not let go. Even if he is disliked by Kui Shai and Chen and his wife and even insulted as a dog raised by the Kui family, he has to endure such humiliation. Facing the savage and willful nature of Kui Shai and Chang's daughter, he has always tried his best to restrain and forbear, just to hold on to the thighs and have a backer in his career. Mu Zifin is really ambitious. But Mu Zifin still didn't know what he had missed until Chu Yun and Qi Lin were together, and Qi Lin found out that Chu Yun's father was actually the mayor of King Gang City. He was surprised to find out what Mu Zifin had missed. You know, Kui Shai and Chen treated Mu Zifin like a dog in front of him, and in front of Chen Kilin, Kui Shai and Chen was submissive, but Chen Kilin was nothing in front of Chu Yun's father, Mayor Chu, and even had to be respectful in front of Shen Sifin. It can be seen how big the gap between them is. Compared with Kui Shai and Chen and his wife, Chu Yun's father was not so sycophantic, and did not look down on Mu Zifin who came from a small place. If Mu Zifin had pursued Chu Yun directly and decisively, he might have succeeded long ago. It can only be said that he really missed a great opportunity to hold onto his thighs. Chu Yun's father was the real thigh. As long as he held onto this thigh, even if Chu Yun's father did not give him a back door, there would be many sensible people like Chen Kilin who would give him a chance to make friends with the mayor. In a word, Mu Zifin really missed a great opportunity. He really lost sight of the main goal and tried to please Kui Shai and Chang's daughter, a willful and capricious young lady. The final outcome can be imagined. Mu Zifin will either be suppressed for the rest of his life or harbor resentment and eventually kill Kui Shai and Chang's family. Qi Lin and Chu Yun got together. Although he had never thought of currying favor with someone, he unexpectedly helped them. With the help of such an invisible thigh, Qi Lin's future will surely be bright. Next news. What happened to Luo Jin? In both dramas, a heroine who played opposite him became the biggest failure in the drama. What happened to Luo Jin? 
the heroines in both dramas became the biggest failure. Luo Jin, the hot commodity in the film and television industry, has been really unlucky recently. The audience has complained about the performance of the heroines in two consecutive dramas. What kind of luck did this powerful male god step on, or did he offend some gods? Let's talk about the story behind it. The first to appear is Reconnaissance Heroes, which should have been a passionate drama about the war to resist U.S. aggression and aid Korea, but it became a god drama because of a heroine named Wen Ji. Comrade Wen Ji, from an ordinary female soldier in the art troupe, has become an omnipotent superhero. Being captured? It's a piece of cake, she escaped easily. Eavesdropping on intelligence? That's not a problem. Even the division commander was fascinated by her charm and didn't forget to find a partner for her on the battlefield. This plot looks like a time travel drama no matter how you look at it. The audience exclaimed, is this a film about the war to resist US aggression and aid Korea or Mulan? Some even complained, this is not a war film, it's clearly an urban idol drama, okay. The actress who played Wenji was even more criticized by the audience. Her expression was as stiff as if she had been injected with Botox, her emotional scenes were like pantomime, and her hot and cold performance made people wonder if she had bipolar disorder. The most ridiculous thing is that in this cruel war background, the characters played by Wenji and Luo Jin are always in love, as if the war is just the background of their love. The audience shook their heads, this is not the war to resist US aggression and aid Korea, it's clearly battlefield love. Just when everyone thought that Luo Jin's nightmare of the heroine was over, execution judge gave the audience another heavy punch. This legal drama, which should have been serious and serious, turned into a scolding competition because of the performance of the heroine Chu Yoon. Judge Chu Yoon has a face that is harder than a gavel. She has never smiled in several episodes. The audience is speculating, did the screenwriter forget to arrange a scene for her to laugh? What's even more ridiculous is that Judge Chu seems to have made arguing with people her lifelong career. She will argue with her subordinates and her bosses when she doesn't like them. She is simply invincible in the world. Some netizens joked, this is not playing a judge, it's clearly playing the king of arguing contest. The actor who plays Chu Yun even interprets facial paralysis to the extreme. That look in her eyes, as if everyone owes her 8 million, and everyone looks like a criminal. The audience said, with this acting skill, I'm afraid she can even win the bitter melon face competition. Facing the Waterloo of these two dramas, Luo Jin probably never dreamed that he would fall to the heroine. One turned a war drama into an idol drama, and the other turned a legal drama into a confrontational drama. This operation is simply amazing. Some netizens joked, Luo Jin, Luo Jin, did you offend the casting director? Why did you arrange these weird partners for you? Others comforted, don't be discouraged, Luo Jin. Next time when you choose a script, be more careful and see if the character of the heroine is a normal person. Faced with such a situation, Luo Jin must be bitter. I wanted to support the whole drama with my own strength and acting skills, but who knew that I was dragged down by the heroines? Now, both dramas have become god dramas, and Luo Jin's acting skills have been buried in the audience's complaints. But then again, this situation is not just Luo Jin. In the entertainment industry, there are many examples of being buried because of the dragging of the partner's acting skills. Just like Stephen Chow in The King of Comedy, he was dragged down by the acting skills of the heroine Cecilia Chun and almost became the best supporting actor. Also, in Painted Skin, although Chang Hun's acting skills are online, he was overshadowed by the exaggerated performance of the heroine Zhao Wei. These examples tell us how important a good partner is in the entertainment industry. Faced with such a dilemma, how can Luo Jin save himself? Some netizens suggested, next time you accept a play, it is better to directly ask for an audition for the heroine to see if the other party is a normal person before deciding whether to accept it. Someone else joked, why don't Luo Jin open a training class to train actresses and ensure that he will never encounter this situation again in the future? In any case, we still hope that Luo Jin can get out of this heroine curse as soon as possible. As a powerful actor, he deserves better scripts and partners. Maybe in the next work, he will meet a heroine who can match him and create a wonderful work together. Let's cheer for Luo Jin. I hope he can get rid of this embarrassing situation as soon as possible and return to the position of the powerful male god in the hearts of the audience. At the same time, I also hope that the actors who play the heroine can take every role seriously, think carefully, and don't let down the good scripts and excellent partners. The entertainment industry has always been a place full of surprises and challenges. Today you may be the target of complaints, 
but tomorrow you may become the new favorite in the hearts of the audience. For Luo Jin, this may be just a small setback. I believe that with his strength and popularity, he will soon be able to make a comeback and bring more wonderful works to the audience. Let us wait and see if Luo Jin's next work will be a surprise. Maybe the next heroine will become his best partner and work together to create a wonderful work that the audience will applaud. After all, in this entertainment industry full of possibilities, any miracle can happen, right? Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,